Hello, welcome to my Excel Power Tips video. Today I'm going to show you how to find hidden name ranges. Now, with your Excel workbook, if you've created uh, your own name ranges, you'll be able to see a list of all your name ranges by going into the, the Formulas tab and clicking on the Name Manager button. And here you'll be able to see all of your name ranges which you have defined. But did you know that uh, sometimes what Excel does, it creates hidden name ranges uh, when if your workbook uh, is passed from one user to another and the users open and close and save those workbooks so sometimes what excel does is creates hidden name ranges and saves it as part of the the excel workbook which you can't see and um and and that bulks up the file size so what i've done is i've created a um an excel vba piece of code uh, which will help you uncover those hidden name ranges so what you do first is uh, you go into your developer tab and click on Visual Basic uh, button, or if you press Alt and F11 keys together, that'll also bring up the the VBA editor. And then uh, what you do is uh, you uh, you go to the this workbook object uh, of the Microsoft Excel objects list of the workbook in which you want to find um, the hidden name ranges. Then you right click, and then you insert a standard module, and then the the VBA code which is in blue. Uh, you insert that into the standard module and then you run it in the normal way uh, by pressing F5 and and now uh, you you also see uh, those um, uh, hidden name ranges which have now been unhidden and then what you can do is you can review each one and decide on what you want to do uh, with those uh, hidden name, name range which have now become visible the going to the VBA code and uh, it works like this um, if I first dim dimension a variable called n as a name and then the for each uh, loop uh, cycles through each of the, the names uh, in the active workbook and then checks its visible pro uh, property. If it's false then it makes it as true. Um, if it's already true, uh, if it's already visible then nothing needs to be done. And then the final piece of uh, code, uh, what it does is shows the name manager dialog box. So then it works and shows you the, the name ranges. Uh, thanks for watching my uh, latest video on uh, name ranges, hidden name ranges, and I'll see you on the next video. Uh, please stay tuned. Bye.